हेलो फ्रेंड्स आई एम जगदीश पर्क असोसिएट टूडेज टॉपिक इज गेट सो इन टूडेज वीडियो आई विल बी एक्सप्लेनिंग ए न्यूमेरिकल प्रॉब्लम फ्रॉम द सब्जेक्ट इंजीनियरिंग मैकेनिक्स ओके सो बिफोर गोइंग टू दिस वीडियो प्लीज प्रेस द सब्सक्राइब बटन ऑफ आवर चैनल द मैकेनिकल इंजीनियर्स टीम एंड ऑल्सो क्लिक द बेल आइकॉन सो दैट यू विल गेट द नोटिफिकेशन फॉर न्यू वीडियोज सो लेट्स बिगिन फर्स्ट आई विल रीड द क्वेश्चन A small block of mass m is sliding on a rough horizontal plane at velocity v not. If the velocity is reduced to v not by two in thirty meters, the block will be brought to rest in the next a ten meter, b twenty meter, c twenty five meter, d thirty meter. Now I will analyze the question. Here is the picture of the small block. The mass of the small block is m. Initially, the small block is sliding on a horizontal plane with a velocity of v naught. After a distance of thirty meter, the velocity of the small block is reduced to v naught by two. And for the next part of the distance, the small block comes to rest. So, in this question, we have to find the distance through which the small block came to rest. To be more precise, whether the small block came to rest at a distance of ten meter or twenty meter. Or 25 meter or 30 meter. Now I will move to the solving technique. First of all, the velocity of the small block is reduced from v naught to v naught by 2, and v naught by 2 to 0, which means the small the small block is continuously undergoing deceleration or retardation. Now we will find the value of deceleration or retardation of the small block for a distance of 30 meter, and the term used for deceleration or retardation is a1. Okay. So for this 30 meter condition. The initial velocity of the small block is v naught. After a distance of 30 meter, the velocity of the small block is reduced to v naught by 2, which means the final velocity of the small block is v naught by 2. So, for finding the value of deceleration or retardation of the small block for a distance of 30 meter, we will use a basic formula, and the formula is v square minus u square is equal to 2 as, where v is final velocity. U is initial velocity, A is acceleration or deceleration or retardation. S is total distance. So for this 30 meter condition, V is V naught by 2, U is V naught, A is A1, S is 30 meter. Okay. Now we will substitute the values in this formula. We get V naught by 2 whole square minus V naught whole square is equal to 2 into A1 into 30 meter. Okay. So here, v naught by two whole square is v naught square divided by four. V naught whole square is v naught square, and two into a one into thirty meter is a one into sixty meter because two into thirty meter is sixty meter. So the next step will be v naught square divided by four minus v naught square is equal to a one into sixty meter. Now we will take LCM in this LHS. And the LCM for this LHS is four. After taking LCM, we get v naught square minus four v naught square whole divided by four is equal to a one into sixty meter. So in this numerator, v naught square minus four v naught square is minus three v naught square. So the next step will be minus three v naught square divided by four is equal to a one into sixty meter. Now bring this 60 meter to the denominator of LHS. We get a1 is equal to minus 3 v naught square whole divided by 4 into 60 meter. So in this denominator, 4 into 60 meter is 240 meter. So the next step will be a1 is equal to minus 3 v naught square divided by 240 meter. In this LHS, 3 and 240 gets cancelled because 240 is 80 times of 3. So the next step will be a1 is equal to minus v naught square divided by 80 meter, and consider this one as equation one. Okay, so friends, please remember in this equation one, the actual deceleration or retardation value of the small block is v naught square divided by 80 meter, and the negative sign is is the representation of represent the negative sign representing that the small block is undergoing deceleration. Okay. The value is v naught square divided by 80 meter. The negative sign is just a representation that 
the small block is undergoing deceleration so for calculation purpose you have to just sub substitute v naught square by 80 meter not the negative sign okay now we will find the value of deceleration or retardation for the distance through which the small block came to rest and the term used for deceleration or retardation here is a2 for finding the value of a2 we will use the basic formula total deceleration or retardation value is equal to final deceleration value deceleration or retardation value minus initial deceleration or retardation value okay so for this distance condition the initial deceleration or retardation value is v naught square divided by 80 meter okay and final deceleration or retardation value is zero because the final position of the small block is rest so at rest position the speed the velocity the acceleration the deceleration the retardation everything will be zero okay so that's why the final deceleration or retardation value of the small block for this distance condition is zero okay now we will substitute these two values in this formula we get a2 is equal to 0 minus v naught square divided by 80 meter so in this origin 0 minus v naught square divided by 80 meter is minus v naught square divided by 80 meter so the next step will be a2 is equal to minus v naught square divided by 80 meter and consider this one as equation 2 now we will find the distance through which the small block came to rest and the term used for this distance is x okay so for finding the distance value we will use the basic formula v square minus u square is equal to 2 as so for this distance condition the final velocity is 0 the initial velocity is v naught by 2 the deceleration or retardation value for the distance condition is minus v naught square divided by 80 meter and the total and the distance is x which we have to find here okay now we will substitute the values we get 0 minus v naught by 2 whole square is equal to 2 into minus v naught square divided by 80 meter into x so here v naught by 2 whole square is v naught square divided by 4 and in this RHS 2 and 80 meter gets cancelled because 80 is 40 times of 2 so the next step will be 0 minus v naught square divided by 4 is equal to minus v naught square divided by 40 meter into x so here in this LHS 0 minus v naught square divided by 4 is minus v naught square divided by 4 so the next step will be minus v naught square divided by 4 is equal to minus v naught square divided by 40 meter into x okay so here the negative sign on the lhs and the negative sign on the rhs gets cancelled and v naught square v naught square gets cancelled now bring this 40 meter to the numerator of lhs we get x is equal to 40 meter divided by 4 so 40 meter divided by 4 is 10 meter so the next step will be x is equal to 10 meter so the answer for this question is the distance through which the small block came to rest is 10 meter okay i hope you all would have understood if any doubts are there please do comment in comment box and remember to like share and comment on our videos thank you friends